Seeking and Finding Jesus Hello friends, we have another reflection guide for you. This Sunday, we read from the Gospel written by Matthew. Jesus was born in the town of Bethlehem in Judea, during the time when Herod was king. Soon afterwards, some men who studied the stars came from the east to Jerusalem and asked, Where is the baby born to be king of the Jews? We saw his star when it came up in the east, and we have come to worship him. Herod sent the visitors to Bethlehem with these instructions. Go and make a careful search for the child, and when you find him, let me know, so that I too may go and worship him. And so they left, and on their way, they saw the same star they had seen in the east. When they saw it, how happy they were! What joy was theirs! It went ahead of them until it stopped over the place where the child was. They went into the house, and when they saw the child with his mother Mary, they knelt down and worshipped him. They brought out their gifts of gold, frankincense, and myrrh, and presented them to him. What is Jesus telling us? The wise men might have expected the young king would be found in a palace in the most important city, but instead they find the child Jesus in a simple house in a small town. Where might we find Jesus today? Jesus has promised he is with us always. We can find Jesus when we gather together for Mass and when we pray and read the Bible. We can find Jesus in each other and in those in need. We can also find Jesus while we are doing our ordinary work by doing it well and offering it to Him. Let's all try to look for Jesus. When the wise men found Jesus, they offered Him expensive presents. Just like the wise men, we can also give gifts to Jesus to show Him that He is important in our lives. Unlike the wise men, we don't have to spend lots of money. We already have special gifts that we can offer. Some of us are good at singing, some of us are kind or funny, some of us are good at sharing or helping others. These are all gifts which we should give to others, especially to the members of our family. Let us reflect. For the parents, do we actively seek Jesus in the ordinary events of our life? For the children, do we use our gifts to make others happy? You may pause to reflect. If you like your reflection guides, please like and subscribe and share it to such other families. See you next Sunday!